Unfortunately, not everyone can be a fantastic hero that drinks dragon blood to become OP, but you know, sure, why not? These are terrible times. Just terrible. Just terrible. You saved us. I can't believe we're alive. And it's finally over. Yes, there's still Darkspawn to deal with. It's not over yet. <laughs> uh, what are you going to do now? With mother and father both gone, I suppose they'll send us to an orphanage. Maybe separated. Hmm. At least we're both alive. An orphanage? How old you are you? Neither of us will. Thank you. Oh, I promise to return your grandfather's sword. I can't take it back. If you need it, keep it. Grandfather would want it in the hands of a hero. Hmm. Uh, you could sell it. I insist you take it. Uh, perhaps I could pay you something for it? Um, uh, I could pay you something for it. I ha have no idea what it's worth, to be honest. And you found Bevan. I couldn't ask you for money. Hmm, it's a very valuable sword. Here, 500 silver. Take it. 500? That's a bit much. It's a valuable sword. Have 100. Let me pay you something at least. Here's 50 silver. 15. Very well. Thank you for the gift. Um... Well, you know, it's... Alright, thank you. Yeah, you know, fuck it. It's, it's... Okay, what should I do? Should I just give her a shit ton of money for no reason, do you think? I wonder if that will actually come back at some point. It's... Uh... I guess I could look it up. I don't think I've ever done done this with the sword before. Uh... Let's see. Uh... Uh... Here we go. A missing child. I think that's the quest line. Um, and let's have a look and see. Sword. Um, give you the key. Fail to persuade, intimidate, etc., etc. Once you return to the Chantry, speak with Caitlin again. If you got the sword from her home, you can mention it to her and get a lot of approval changes. If you promise Bevan to pay for the sword and you tell Caitlin about his promise, so let's do 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 do. Let's see if I pay for it. It's a ridiculous amount of money, though. If you promise to return the sword to her and try to return it, she says you can keep it. If you offer to pay her for it, Morrigan will really hate that and will be out 500 silver. If Stennis in the party says the helpless need not ask for what is deserved. If you have at least one gold, he gives, uh, gives her one gold. If Stennis not in the party... If you didn't offer to return the sword before the battle, well, I did. Um, other than the money you may lose, you'll receive the geek green blade, a decent one-handed sword. If you opt to return the sword after the battle, be re reported in the epilogue that Bevan became a famous adventurer and told stories about how, as a young man, he met the warden. Oh, my God. So there's actually something there in the uh, in the thing. Okay. Okay. Well, if there's something in the epilogue, I'm going to return it then. Um... No? Good. <laughs> <laughs> That's not what I meant. Join the Grey Wardens. Steal from orphans. <laughs> Let's kick a grandmother next. That should make us real popular. Huh. Then use it well. We should leave now, I suppose. There's a wagon taking us north, and I don't want to miss it. <laughs> I didn't even have, have, have the option to back out and say, no, you should just have it. It's <laughs> more kind of bruise. Oh my god, alright. So you don't even have the option to back out of that. That's fantastic. <laughs> That's fantastic. We've ruined someone's life. Alright. Two orphans now, without a sword and no money. Alright, we can totally fix that though. I'm still fighting's not over. Uh, we still I could have use a good commander to myself. That's a commendable to attitude. Court. If you'll excuse me, I think I'll offer the maker a bit. Okay, well I had a chat with you. Okay. We can do this properly now. <laughs> oh, God. This time, don't accept it. At least we'll get an epilogue entry for it if we don't take you it. Saved us. I can't believe we're alive. Uh, I won't forget what you did, though. I promise to Not, return the sword. I can't take it back. If you need it, keep it. Oh. Grandfather would want it in the hands of a hero. You could sell it. I insist you take it. Oh, I wager she is robbed of it the moment we leave. <laughs> suppose it's quite valuable, isn't it? Perhaps someone in the city will buy it. Hmm. Thank you again. We should leave now, I suppose. There's a wagon taking us north, and I don't want to miss it. Right, yo. Farewell. Bye bye Oh, dear. Major cunning. Oh, my God. Everyone approves except Morrigan. Makes perfect sense. Dog doesn't give a shit, no matter what we do. 
Alright, well I lost the sword. I better equip something else then. Uh, Warden's longsword. Okay, well you know what, I'm taking my sword back. Because you've got my good one now. Um, let's see, 840. Wait, hang on. No, I'll, ta I'll, keep I'll take the Oath Keeper sword. That sounds exciting. There we go. <laughs> Steel Oath Keeper, and then we got the Longbow Ash. Is that better than what I have here? That one's you. Uh, Ash is slightly better. Although that one has nature resistance. Don't think I care, though. I could give it to someone else. Um, let's see. Short bow. Uh, oh, that's a wild's bow. Okay, and it's a short bow, whereas in now I have a, a long bow. Okay, fair enough. Alrighty. Um, I think that's all we really have there, so that's good. Uh, I better give someone a leather helm just for now before I can sell it. You'll do. Um, and we're good. Okay. Fantastic. We've made, we've uh, we've left her the sword this time, and uh, aren't I a good boy? Uh, what's this then? Um, Holo cure. I don't know anything about Holo cure. What's she doing? Where's she going? Oh, it's a Yagu statue. Was she nicking things? What's she doing? <laughs> Oh dear, what a naughty waifu. Stealing things like that, honestly. Alrighty then, um... Uh, I've got to turn in more quests though, don't I? Um, at least I think I do. Journal! Um, meet Bantega in the castle. Lost in the castle. Oh yes, i got to get this, uh, this, uh, daughter. Owen's daughter, I have to bring her back as well. Oh boy. Hello, i everything's good now. May God bless you, child. Without your help, we surely would have lost. I know. Good to see you again. Oh. Huh. Uh, is everything all right? So far. I'll be fighting Darkspawn soon enough. I don't look forward to it. Oh, dear. With the Maker's luck, I'll live through it all to tell my grandchildren a tale or two. Here's to hoping you can do the same. That would be good. That would be. I did fix my Hollow Cure form. I did. Can't remember who I added, though. Hello, child. It's all over now. When is Mother coming back? Her mother is dead. <laughs> Your mother is dead, and she was also a whore. Hello. Good day. Yes, hello. See, we solved all your problems. So much life lost. I wonder if the village will ever truly recover. Oh, you'll be fine. I don't know what we're going to do now. Darkspawn will come now, won't they? Hmm. Maybe. I do have Coroni and Miko. I do. Oh, okay. Well, we did some things. Um, uh, oh, it's a doomsayer. Hello. Another one of you, huh? The end is upon us. The dead rise and foul magic spreads across the land. Oh, you are such a twat. Repent your sins before death. Beg for the Maker's divine forgiveness. But <laughs> you need to stop that right now. Please calm down. You're hysterical. Have you repented your sins? <laughs> oh... I need you, you need to stop that right now. I cannot. It is my sacred duty. Magic is everywhere. Everywhere. The time to repent has come. Oh dear. Intimidate. Find some place else to rant or else. Let me put you out of your misery. Kill him. Uh, I'll just leave you to your ranting. I do not rant. I speak the truth. Repent. Repent. <laughs> Pity I didn't get to stab him. That would have been great. Can repent I still stab him? Oh, I can still death. stab him. I have. Have you repented for I your have sins? Repented. Oh, Maker! Forgive me my sins! Forgive my fellow brothers and sisters! Look upon us with kindness as we are swallowed by the darkness! <laughs> That's good. Kill him. At long last, the <laughs> end has come! <laughs> oh, I am ready! <laughs> yes, stab him! This is a bit awkward, but alright. Yeah. Well, this, well, this is going not quite how I expected, but sure. <laughs> there you go, he's dead. There we go, and he's a bit frozen as well. He doesn't even have anything on him. What a twat. <laughs> oh dear, alright, fine. I won't murder the guy. Even though he is a massive asshole. Uh, I'll just let him sit there. Sure, why not? Alrighty then, um... Yeah, I'll just chat with everyone before I get going, I suppose. Get going to the castle. Good to see you in one piece. Hmm. 
do you have news of Elena yet? Uh, no, and I doubt it will. Not, not yet. Well, I'll give it some time. Now's the best time to go into the castle, though, and see for yourself. Hmm. Remember, a promise is a promise. Yeah, I suppose so. Uh, let's talk business. Right. I haven't got much, obviously, but I'll do whatever I can for you. That guy was literally suicidal. I was expecting him to just die in a cutscene, but no, I had to uh, kill him like that. <laughs> Helm of the Red. Oh, no, don't sell that. We just got it. Wild's bow? Yeah, I'll sell that, I guess. And I guess I can take Liliana's ha helmet off, but then again, it gives her something. It gives her some armor, so why the fuck not? <laughs> there we go. Alright, cool. Everything else is fine, I think. Right. Once we've checked in on everyone, I think I'll head off to the castle. Horror awaits those who perish outside of the <laughs> Shut up, you dickhead. Uh, Alright, well, we'll go to Dwin's home. Shall be done. I think he survived. At least I think he did. Oh yeah, he's good. Phew, some I need him for a side quest. Reminds me why I left Orzammar in the first place. Hmm. Why is that? Constant fighting. A warrior's life there is blood, ash, and dust. Though I'm not sure who's dirtier. These creatures are dark spawn. Hmm. What do you intend to do now? Rebuild. Same thing I intended to do before. Except this time, there's more humans left alive to help. Hmm. First thing I'm gonna do is get some sleep. For about a week. Go celebrate I hear that. whatever it is you're gonna do. You won, right? You're a hero. Or something. Oh, something. <laughs> I'm something, I guess. Go celebrate, or whatever you have to do. Uh... I could use your help with the Darkspawn. If I wanted to fight Darkspawn, I'd have stayed in Orzammar. No thanks. Mm, okay. Thank you for helping with the battle. Hey, anything for Redcliffe, right? Whatever. First thing I'm gonna do is get some sleep. For about a week. Go celebrate or whatever it is you're gonna do. You won, right? You're a hero. Or something. Well, I'm certainly glad he survived in the end. Because otherwise we'd be locked out of a pretty good side quest. And, uh, yeah, that would suck. That would really suck. Uh, although I think there's a, 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 uh, I think there's a safeguard to that where you can still complete the quest even without him. But I, I'm not 100% certain about that. Oh, the Chanter's board is up. Oh, and the Blackstone Irregulars are in as well. Hello. The deep dark before dawn's first light seems eternal. But know that the sun always rises. Eh, uh, sure. Let's see what we got here. Caravan down. Sister Giselle posts, Unfortunate news has arrived that the Darkspawn have extended their incursion into areas previously thought safe for travel. A runner from a border caravan uh, brings word that they unknowingly passed into an infested territory and were being tracked by several unseen creatures. He was dispatched to seek help and does not know the fate of his fellows or the viability of the trade route. Travelers in the area are urged to be cautious and with the ability to rescue or uh, determine the status of the trouble group will be rewarded. I'll take it. Brothers and sons, Sister Rana posts on behalf of her neighbors, the dark spawn incursions in the south have made uh, made for difficult communication, even th through official means. The relatives of the conscripts in com Company East Hill have beseeched me to deliver word of their brothers and sons. I have no means to do so, but you can point a traveller of st stout heart in the proper direction of their recent arrangement. Um, can oh, to, to any who are able to find their loved ones, I offer what little silver they have been able to entrust to the board, as well as the sincerest gratitude of the Chantry. I'll take it. Skin deep. A runner sends his request for from uh, Knight Commander Tams. Uh, it, while the reports I have heard no doubt suffer from exaggeration, the observed creatures assaulting Redcliffe trouble me greatly. If we are to properly combat these unnatural agents and prevent their reoccurrence, the mages bound to my service will require carefully prepared samples of flesh for study. Thereafter, should a deployment occur, we will be well briefed. If if there are skilled warriors present. Uh, I would have them gather samples from any remaining creatures as close to the presumed source as possible. The Chantry will reward this basic assistance with spiritual acknowledgement. If the quest is exceeded, uh, gold will be added, but the offer is limited. And finally, we've got Desperate Haven as well. Um, Sister Rana has heard reports of an imme uh, uh, of an, um, uh, an eminent tragedy. A runner has brought me dying news of a group of refugees fleeing the Darkspawn. They have been concerned, uh, cornered in unfamiliar ground, fighting for their lives. The Templars are necessarily occupied, and my own means are few and stretched. 
If somebody of skill has the ability to deliver these people, I can only offer the honest gratitude of myself and of the Chantry. Hopefully that'll be enough for the rare person we need. I guess so. I mean, I do have a decent amount of money, sure. Let's see how the Blackstone Irregulars are doing. Oh, look, he's he's survived Lothering, I guess. Make his blessings upon you, Warden. Indeed. Let's have a look and see. Grease the wheels. My friend, I have a task that requires some tact and discretion, and I think you're perfect for the job. The Blackstone Irregulars cannot survive without the patronage of the nobles, mages, and other groups who retain our services. For that work to continue, however, we have ensured that people are looking out for our interests. To that end, I ask you to make a trip to Denerim and pass our appreciation to certain individuals. Return when you are done, and I'll see that you're rewarded. Your friend, Tauron. Alright, new quest on that as well, and that'll be done in Denerim, which I guess I'll visit next time we do this, sure. I guess. We'll just have to wait and see how that pans out. Oh yeah, I should go see Lloyd and get, uh, get my reward for... For keeping him alive. Oh dear. I'm not sure, but it seems male cats are more affectionate. I don't know, my cat's pretty affectionate. She's a girl cat. Okie dokie. Oh, okay. Everyone's here at the tavern now. <laughs> Hello. Oh, it's Bella. She's cute. I admit, for a while, I didn't think either of us would survive. It's good to see you did. Indeed. Uh... Don't I deserve a hero's welcome? It's good to see you too. Thank you. I'm in no mood to chat. I believe I made you a promise. You mean about helping me leave? Hmm. I... I wouldn't hold you to that. You've already done so much for us. Okay. Uh, but you can do better than this place. What do you have in mind? Let's see. Um, how about a hundred silver? At least you'd get out of Redcliffe. Five hundred silver ought to be enough to start a new life. Why don't you come with me? Travel with you. That sounds very dangerous. That's I, true. I don't think a woman like me would do well in that sort of life. Mm. A woman like you, perhaps. <laughs> I appreciate your offer, but I don't think I can do that. Oh dear. After I sent that message, I went to get something to drink. I was just talking about how my cat's pretty affectionate. She's a girl cat. Um, let's see. I'll give you 500 silver. This is a disastrous idea, but I'll do it anyway. Should be enough to start a new life. What? You jest, surely. Why not simply throw all our coin into the river? Oh dear. We can afford this much. Oh, have it your way then. But that could get me to dinner. Hmm. What would you want in return for such a gift? Oh, there are so many things. Your thanks is enough. How about a kiss from the lovely lady? I promise not to work in a place like this. Well, I might as well get another kiss. <laughs> you men are all the same. There we go. <laughs> Yay. More wife wing Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> on the bar, it's like, what? She's usually such a cold fish. Kissing serving wenches now. Perhaps you intend to roll around in the nearest pig pen as well? Well, I yes. Suppose that's one way to celebrate. <laughs> Thank you. I I can never repay this, but I'll think of a way. I swear. Oh, you don't have to think too long. I've got some other suggestions. 